This is a short how-to video of how to turn your jet your power washer into a jetter. So first and foremost, if you ever get your line jetted by a plumber, it's around 300 and something an hour. Okay? And that's a lot of money. So, what I did was I bought a jetter for, you know, like a 200 bucks, and then you buy the hosing that goes to an actual jetting machine which is like you know another couple hundred bucks and then you have to buy some fittings now these pop in and off as you can see but you have to have these these fittings so you can actually do the hookup without this you'll never be able to hook it up now the good news is these hoses are rated for like 10,000 PSI, which is an absurd amount of pressure. Most jetters like this, I mean, most power washers are never gonna exceed anything over like 3,500 or 4,000. And that's a good thing. You'll never have a line bust. The other good news is that you can now jet your main line with, this is a main line one here, does up to like five inch maybe a little higher. This one right here, this smaller line, is for your inside lines. This does, you know, two inches up to like three inches. You're also gonna have to buy tips. You're gonna wanna have different tips for this. You're gonna have ones that bust through, ones that spray back, they got spinning tips. But if you do that, you could actually be self-reliant and not have to worry about calling a plumber out to do your main line. Now I know this is a quick how-to. Hopefully I said enough about how to actually do all this. If not, you can always ask a question, but it is very simple. Buy a jetter hose line. A hundred foot should be good enough. Get one that's for a main line or for your smaller line, depending on what you have problems with. I bought both just in case. The two lines together, maybe another 150 bucks maybe a little bit less depending on you know the psi pressure i got ones that are like fourteen thousand psi you know just in case i ever went up higher i wasn't really sure and it's better to be have a stronger hose than a weaker one but now with those attachments on it i can hook it up to any power washer no matter what power washer it is that line will go into it as long as you got the those hookups and you must buy these fittings let me see. See how it clips on? It's just a little clip. And then you just stick it in there just like you would a, an airline hose, no different. But you need this. Without this, you cannot hook up this jetter line. It will not work. Same with this. Without this fitting right here, you cannot hook up this jetter line. It will not work. You have to have both of those fittings. Okay. Good luck and I, I hope this helps you.